system test four and a half. Not many changes in the system today, but there's there's some. Another cat. There's no 276B anymore. And I was going to put up the MS2 in its place, but I didn't. Instead, I have a new pull station, and it is in, I have an auto call 4050001T. And, oh, I got to turn the panel on. I don't trust this thing at all to keep away from false alarms. Not, not in the least bit. And as per usual with half tests, the horns are disconnected, so. MT24 LSM FOS, which is flashing normally. Still got the T VAR and this which seems dimmer than usual hope it's not breaking or something it's Right. All right, and I have crap. What did I do? Oh, here it is. I have a Phillips head screwdriver because that's how you reset these things. Uh-oh. Panel's doing that thing again. It's bugging out. Because the lobe of the batteries. I haven't changed the batteries since the last system test, but the strobes still work, so. At least reset it. So and just for sake of the completeness of this test, I'll go, I'll do the T-bar. You look freaked out, cat. Like you've never seen a strobe before. Well, hope you enjoyed this video. Oh, and... I don't have many subscribers, but there was one person that suggested something, and... I told them I couldn't do it because I was missing a back box for something. So if you can find that and figure out what the suggestion was, the one person that suggested something on one of my videos before, then you'll know what's going to be in the next system test because I got a back box for it. Also, at some point, I also am going to do this. This is the 7002T rebranded by Honeywell. and. This broke, so I had to compensate for that. So there might be some, there might be a surprise uh, in the next system test video. But that's it for this one. Goodbye.